Hey Internet, welcome back to another episode of Road to 120 Archaeology. Let's begin. So we just extended our Archaeology Daily. Okay. 137k. We'll open up a Treasure Hunter. It's a red. Okay. Interesting. Uh, I'll go for cosmetics then. It's kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. Okay. I can redeem one. Great, and I can sell the other one. Is that a million dollars? Alright, okay. Maybe a little bit cheaper than that. Okay. Well. Alright. Let's go to Caradet. Not much progress. Still the same. So we're around about 8.4 mil yesterday. We're 7 mil today, but it feels like I haven't done much training, to be honest. So we're just here. So we'll just turn on our porters, light our incense, summon our water fiend. I know there's a deposit cut just above us, but since it's a April skilling week this week, we're getting 50% more XP in getting materials so excavating so that's why I'm just going the AFK mode or try to minimize banking as much as possible to maximize XP alright and with this excavation site, only the ancient globes are useful because the other two uh, have quite a high material requirement. So I'll be here for a long time if I'm just doing ancient globes, which is fine because those high requirement ones can be used at 119 such as battle plans. Alright. So pretty much this is me for the next three weeks, I think. Maybe four, so one month of just um, training here. Excuse the dead ear. I'm either coughing or burping. And, well, you don't want to hear that on recording. Alright. I feel like there's not much to say, but I gotta make that 10 minute video. So, what else can I say? So, real life situation. No change, still looking for jobs. In terms of the other channel, I think it's doing alright. So two videos kind of went, like it got popular, but not quite popular that I'm getting heaps of subs, So, but popular enough that I'm getting heaps of views. 
So I'm still watching this space and just observing what's happening. Uh, the other channel is a gaming channel. It's for Genshin Impact. So Genshin Impact is a free-to-play but gacha kind of game. Not sponsored, by the way. Just uh, we're just talking about my other channel. And yeah, just it's um, you know I just do let's play. It's like I just go around the overworld and just like um, defeating bosses and stuff. And I kind of just like do like whatever events are on. And apparently people like that, so I'll just keep doing that. And I mean I can probably do that the same for RuneScape, but. RuneScape, I actually have like goals in mind, so it's a little bit different. Okay, so after recording, since I've got my water fiend out, I'm just going to be like training for like another hour. So that's that plan. Okay. Yeah, farming's still going pretty slow. Getting maybe 300k a week, no, 300k a day. 100k to 300k a day in XP for farming. I'm not too concerned about it. As soon as I get 118 or 120 archaeology, I am going to work on farming. Yeah, I keep talking about, like, what I'm working on, but, like, it's not really happening because you can't see what's behind the scenes. So when I get to Slayer, I think I will branch off into three different types of uh, Road to X kind of uh, format. So like this kind of video, Road to 120, but for Slayer, it'll be Road to 120 Slayer, and then it'll be like completing the Slayer Pokedex gotta catch every single slayer monster for the souls so I can do a like a progression videos on those ones and what else can I talk about for slayer I'll probably be doing like a road to ability X or something like that because there are quite a few abilities to unlock for slayer so I am working on that as well, but not right now. But that's what I'm planning to do later on. So in terms of content, it's coming eventually. But uh, yeah, just got to get through archaeology and farming first. All right. Okay. Do I sound a bit tired? Yeah, yeah, you know. So I do get eight hours sleep, but uh, I do work quite late uh, editing videos and stuff. So, you know, I've been doing this for four months straight. Like, I only have two days off, which, like, that's pretty normal for everyone, so. I do feel a little bit fatigued making videos, but, uh, you know, as long as the videos are getting views, I'll continue making them. So, one tw uh, 120 at Dungeoneering, 200 mil. I'm working on it. I'm doing sinkholes nearly every day. Uh, except for the days where I've got, like, things in real life that I need to do, which I can't, um, like not do that's the only time that I can only skip those days but it is what it is okay we are nearing our 10 minute mark probably another two minutes of just random talking okay I know I'm just explaining what I'm planning to do and 
as the viewer you only care about what's the next video you know that's fair so I guess a little insight if you just watch these videos consecutively like if you watch these videos then you'll kind of know what's coming up next so it's not that I'm like content drought I just don't have any immediate content right now but that being said on Thursday I believe I will be doing uh, another is it worth your investment video now these two items that I'm going to talk about everybody's talked about them so every content creator is talking about them well they've been talked about so much that it's oversaturated and yes it is the grace of the owls and luck of the dwarves I didn't want to make that video but because it's so oversaturated but I'll just give my take on it so stay tuned on Thursday and just watch my breakdown and analysis of why you should or shouldn't um, invest your GP so sh uh, materials into getting these items the video will not surprise you it's like a cookie cutter video but at the same time it, you may reconsider in, in, in your investment I should say okay well thanks for watching hope you had a great day be sure to like subscribe share with your friends ring the bell turn on all notifications leave a comment you know what are you doing for the bonus XP skilling week it's not double XP it's you know you know the one I'm talking about all right until next time see ya